Hi friends, today I will show you automatic emergency light using Triplify IC. This is simple circuit of automatic emergency light. It is called dark dependent circuit. A Triplify timer, IC and LDR is used for this configuration. When light falls on the LDR, its resistance decreases and, and in dark position its resistance is going high. Using this characteristics of LDR, automatic emergency light is made. LDR is called light dependent resistor. Its resistance is inversely proportional to the falling to the falling light on its surface. In dark, its resistance is approximately 7k to 10k. When light falls on its surface, its resistance decreases to less than 1k. In the circuit, a voltage divider arrangement circuit is used here with LDR and 10k resistor. When light falls on the surface of LDR, the resistance decreases to 1K, so the voltage of the timer pin 6 is greater. This is the reason the output pin 3 goes low, so the light is off. But whereas in dark position, the LDR resistance increases to high, so the voltage of trigger pin 2 decreases to less. In this case, the output pin 3 goes high, so the light is on and it emits light. Now friends, I'll show you relay connections. See, this is one, this is one, two, three, and this is four, and this is five. F three is connected from inside. This is three. Here I have connected three and two. Three and two are connected here. And this is five. 5 is already connected from inside. 3 and 5 are already connected from inside. Now we have to connect this SMD on 4. 4 is connected from here to the negative of the power supply. And LED is connected to the parallel of the coil. 1 and 2, 1 and 2 is the relay coil. Friends, now I am going to show you adapter pin socket. This socket is used to recharge the battery. Recharge battery. Here are three pins are there. You can see this diode is connected. Positive positive power supply positive line is connected through the diode. And these are two are negative. When we put this adapter pin here, now I will show you the power supply. When we put the power supply here, we are going, we are going to get the power supply on this pin. This is going towards the, this is going towards the battery. See. can see now see friends it is showing 12.1 voltage it will not show you on this pin it will not show you on this pin on this pin it is going it's not showing you because this as this pin has been disconnected through this Adopt, adopter pin now you will get these two pins are getting connected because i have taken out the adopter adopter pin now you can see the both the now you can see the continuity will be there on both both the, both of this pin see this here you can see here i have connected this two pin This is continuity tester. Be sure to see the positive pol polarity of the diode. Power supply is going from here to this direction. And the, the white line is showing here. Okay, friends. Thank you.
here positive line is common for both battery and adapter you can see friends both the pins are both the uh, one point is common positive line is common for battery and adapter now friends we are going to test the circuit here i am connecting positive terminal and here negative terminal now we are going to switch on it's in the light position it is in the light position yes it's working let us see yes it is in the dark see it is in the dark that's why light is glowing now if i take this one out see it is in the light it's not glowing if i keep this one on this area it's glowing see now you can see it's glowing now light is falling on the LDR that's why it's not glowing if I close this LDR it starts glowing circuit is working now we are going to test now we are going to test this adopter this is the adopter pin i'll show you this is the adopter pin now we are going to connect this one now we are going to connect the adopter here when i connect the adopter light is falling on this let us put it in the dark. Okay. Now LDR is in a dark position. If I connect this LDR, it, it should stop blowing. See. The light is coming. Now LDR now LED is glowing because battery is charging now if I take this adopter now see now it's not now the battery is been supplying the power to the circuit when I keep this adopter LED is glowing battery is recharging and circuit is in a off position adopter is not Adopt, adopter supply is not entering the circuit now it is in a recharging position here I have kept one indicator here if it blows now it is in a recharge position ok thank you it's working
Hi friends, now the equipment is in dark position, that's why it is on. Now we'll put the light on it and see whether it works or not. See, yeah, it's working. When light falls on the LDR, it switches off. Now it glows, see. Yeah, it's working. Now we are going to put the light again. See, when light falls on it, it switches off. And when it is dark, it switches on. Let us see again. See, 
switches off because the light is falling on the LDR. Okay, it's working. Now we are going to test. Now we are going to test adopter. When we are putting the adopter in the socket, the battery is recharging and the device is switching off because now it is in a charging mode. You can see the green light here. This is indicating that the battery is charging. Okay friends, battery charging is also working. Now if I take this out, see, now the battery is operating. Let us see again, so when light falls on it, it switches off and it switches on when it is dark. Okay friends, big thumbs up.